distal biceps tendon rupture. The biceps is a strong muscle that lies in front of the arm. The biceps is attached to the shoulder by the proximal biceps tendon and is attached to the radial tuberosity below the elbow by the distal biceps tendon. The biceps helps in flexing the elbow and spinating the forearm. Spination is the function used when turning a key or a doorknob. At the shoulder, the proximal biceps tendon may be involved in tendinitis, slap tear, or rupture of the tendon itself. When the proximal biceps tendon ruptures, the muscle moves towards the elbow and becomes a big ball of muscles called the Bapai muscle. A rupture of the distal biceps tendon occurs around the elbow joint and usually it occurs in men. A proximal rupture of the biceps tendon can be left alone especially in the elderly. However, a distal rupture of the biceps tendon should be repaired. This rupture usually occurs in athletes such as in bodybuilders or in manual laborers. Rupture of the tendon usually involves flexion of the elbow against resistance. With that eccentric loading, there will be a sudden tearing of the tendon. The patient will feel a pop with pain, swelling, ecchymosis, and weakness of the elbow. The biceps muscle may retract into the upper arm, causing a pump or a Popeye sign. Examination will show weakness around the elbow, inflection and spination. The biceps will migrate proximally, Popeye sign, and a hook test. A complete biceps tendon tear is detected by performing the hook test, spinate the flexed elbow, and palpate the tendon from the lateral side. This is a test that's been published. If there is no tendon that can be hugged with the index finger, then this is an abnormal hook test indicating that the tendon ruptured distally. Rupture of the biceps tendon may lead to weakness of the elbow and forearm if not repaired. MRI showing rupture of the distal biceps tendon. We repair the distal biceps tendon rupture because the patient will lose approximately 40% of the spination and 30% of flexion of the elbow. Repair should be done early within a few weeks or the tendon will be retracted proximally, scarred and will be difficult to pull down and if it is longer than four weeks, the operation will be harder and a tendon graft will be needed. The procedure, distal tendon biceps repair, marking the site for the incision. Transverse incision over the antecubital fossa. Identify and protect the lateral antibrachial cutaneous nerve. Spinate the forearm to protect the radial nerve. Look proximally to find and extract the tendon to prepare for repair. Find the radial tuberosity. Put two anchors in the bone. Suture the tendon and tie the tendon to the bone. It's spent for about four weeks. Repair ended. We are ready for closure. After surgery, thumb up. The radial nerve is working. After surgery, the clinic visit wound with sutures. All my videos and this video is for educational purposes only. Please consult your doctor before you make any decision about your medical care.